to our uh, Easter Friday service this morning. I'm going to have some worship, and then Pastor Derek's going to share some. So if you're joining us uh, for the live service this morning, we want to we want to come in with our hearts in the right place, Lord Jesus. We want to come in focused in on you and who you are. Help us to lay aside all of our stresses and all of our worries and to focus in on who you are. And the things of the world will be dim as we focus in on you. Amazing love that welcomes me the kindness of mercy that bought with blood wholeheartedly my soul undone God your soul from Luke 23 verse 44 and it was now about the sixth hour and darkness came over the whole land until the ninth hour for the sun stopped shining and the curtains of the temple were torn in two and Jesus called out with a loud voice Father into your hands I commit my spirit and when he said this he breathed his last
suffering Lord I will remember what Calvary has bought for me both now and forever yes sure this life suffering Lord I will remember what Calvary has bought for me both now and forever thousand years are over Satan will be released from his prison and he will go out and deceive the nations in the four corners of the earth Gog and Magog to gather them for battle in number they are like the sand on the seashore they marched across the breadth of the earth and surrounded the camp of God's people they surrounded the city that he loves and completely devoured them.
heaven, a new heaven and a new earth. For the first heaven and the first earth had passed away. There was no longer any sea and I saw the holy city, the new Jerusalem, coming down from heaven, out of God, prepared as a bride, beautifully dressed for her husband. And then I heard a loud voice from the throne saying, now the dwelling of God is with men. And he will live with them forever and they will be his people. And God himself will be with them. He will be their God and he will wipe away every tear from their eyes. There will be no more death. There will be no more mourning or crying or in pain. There will be no more pain for the old order of things has passed away. And he who was seated on the throne said, I am making everything new said write these words down they are trustworthy they are true he said it is finished I am the Alpha and Omega I am the beginning and the end to him who is thirsty I will give to drink without cost from the spring of the water of life and he who overcomes will inherit all of this and I will be his God he will be my son. He will be my child. God, you're so good. God, you're so good. God, you're so Yeah. 
goodness and we revel in your glory Lord Jesus we revel in being surrounded by you held by you lifted by you we revel in the intimacy of your presence we revel in the strength of your spirit the joy and the hope and the peace that we have that passes all understanding we revel in living in the city of God even now, and even in the promise of the city of God to come, we revel in you. You are holy Lamb of God. For what you have purchased, you will receive glory forever and ever and ever. And every generation will tell it to the next generation. That you are Lamb of God and glorify you. Thank you for joining us for worship. Uh, don't go away. I'm going to stop the live feed now and then Pastor Derek is going to take over. I've really gotten a lot out of his messages in the evenings this week. And I'm sure that he's got something good for us this morning. And uh, let's just continue our journey with Jesus. It's going to be a couple of minutes and then the next live feed will start. So don't disappear. <laughs> 